Hello, I'm Brian Day with Truth and Privacy Talks, information for crypto experts and newbies both. Computer scientists agree that proof-of-work algorithms will eventually succumb to faster computers. Can anything be done to prevent centralization by a group of people with single purpose or quantum computers? Well, back in 2009, Bitcoin offered mining awards for participants with general use PCs. PC central processing units are designed for multitasking a wide variety of functions. In search of greater mining profits, mining algorithms were ported to graphic processing units, which are designed to run similar jobs one at a time repetitively, which makes GPUs more profitable than CPUs. Field programmable gate arrays are designed to run single programs quickly. FPGAs that are designed for mining are significantly faster than GPUs. FPGAs have the ability to run different mining algorithms, so a faster solution is to embed the algorithm on the chip, thereby dedicating the computer to one coin. The more processing that is done on the chip, the faster it will run. FPGAs have the flexibility to run different mining apps, so a faster solution is to embed the algorithm on the chip, thereby dedicating the computer to one algorithm. The more processing that is done on the chip, the faster it will run. Application-specific integrated circuits have the complete algorithm on the chip, and they're optimized further by minimizing the lengths of critical signal paths. Now, the only way to profitably mine Bitcoin is with ASICs. Deployment of ASICs for Bitcoin mining destroyed an original goal of enabling anyone with a general purpose PC to participate. Now, a small group of people could buy the next generation of ASICs and compromise Bitcoin or any other currency relying on proof of work alone. Serious attempts have been made to create ASIC resistant algorithms like Monero's hard fork in 2018. Within weeks, however, Chinese manufacturer Bitmain announced ASICs for Monero. Various engineers wondered, is there an ASIC equivalent in modern computers that could provide an advantage over GPUs, FPGAs, and ASICs? Intel and AMD both implemented instruction sets on the chip. These include advanced encryption standard, advanced vector extensions, and careless multiplication. Think of it as a mini ASIC on your PC, enabling simultaneous calculations without accessing slower system components. Verus Hash leverages these hardware-based instruction sets, and as a result, general use PCs can once again be used to earn mining awards. Finally, if an ASIC is eventually built to run Verus Hash, it can be changed to make the ASICs less effective. ASICs themselves are not a problem, but ignoring the risk of a few people using more powerful computers can be dangerous. One night last September, the Federal Reserve Bank injected a quarter of a trillion dollars into the overnight banking market, the repo market. Now to most people, spending 10 to 20 billion dollars for a mining farm is a prohibitive barrier for entry, but to a central bank, that's chump change. This is one of the many reasons we're bullish on Verus. Thank you so much for listening. Have a nice day.